Hello, Skip. She ready to go, I reckon. Oh, Struth, it's happened. Bloody hell, Skip. G'day, Jacko. Yeah, Smithy, far away, are you? Just around the corner. Can I get a lift? No drama, mate. Ripper. Thank you, see you in 10. I'm a huge fan of the bush and there's no better place to self-isolate. I've been preparing for this isolation for a very long time time. What a beautiful place this is to ride the quarantine out. Luckily enough for me, I've prepared a stash of the bare essentials that we're going to need to get through this thing. So come with me, we'll see what we can find. The most important part about knowing your way around the bush is being able to read the area around you. This little sign here, we've got an arrow pointing that way. So we have to do 69 steps. So let's get cracking. One, two, 68. 60, not, voila, look at this, we have arrived. Oh, <laughs> magical, eh? That's not a knife, this is a knife. Oh, she's a good esky, this one. Still fresh as a daisy in there. The trusty weapon. Let's chuck the camo on, get out there and find some dinner. Let's get going. The best way to catch the prey is to look like the prey. Rightio, down here it looks like we've got some bush berries. These are like normal berries, but they're just from the bush. Simply take them. Come here. Get a bit closer. You see a small wallaby. I mean, I'm gonna jump on it and go whack, whack. Looking for me knife. What's a man without a knife? Oh, there she is, hey? Well, the one that got away, eh? We'll go see what we can catch in the sky. Rightio, now we have some heavy artillery. We're gonna see what we can get. Yes! Building your shelter is almost as important as marking your territory. You do not want to become the prey. Excuse me, fellas, if you could. <sighs> She's not bad in here. Pretty, um, oh, oh. Ah, ah. Oh, boys. Even though we are out here in the bush and there's not, not anyone around, we still have to stay clean and hygienic. This bar of soap is going to get us clean, or, or me clean, unless you want to come in too. Holy oh. Nature's bathtub, this oh, thing. No better way. Get out, get out. Well, speaking of dinner, the crocs aren't the only ones that are in need of a feed. Rightio, the day's getting on. Let's get a fire going. Alpha mayo! Good thickness. So we've got a good assortment of hard and soft wood. So here we have a eucalypt and a pine. Rubbing the hard wood against the soft wood aggressively will make smoke and will start a fire. Oh. So let's get going. Oh! There she is, eh? I think it's time to put this little guy to good use and get ready for dinner. We're gonna start off here with some extra virgin olive oil and then a bit of secret sauce here. Fill him up, get it nice and full in there. We're gonna get a couple of chili flakes and then salt. It's all about salt. You wanna get that on there good. Really tenderize the meat. Put the extra seasoning in. If there's any extra sticks and stuff, you can normally pull them out. Personal preference, all leave them in. Oh yeah, a bit more oil. Dinner on the oven. Time to go out there and make the most of the Aussie bush. Do what we do best, eh? Let's <laughs> go. 
some quarantining done and dusted. There's nothing wrong with that, is there, eh? Oh, I have a perfectly home bush cooked meal ready to go. Oh, the f happened here? Oh, f me! Well, it turns out fuel's pretty flammable. Time to get some new sticks and start rubbing. Well guys, dinner was a little overcooked, but all in all, thanks for coming and doing quarantine with me. We saw some pretty special places. We ate some pretty interesting things. And I think all in all, we had a great time. So it's time to hit the hay. Oh, wow.